Hello everyone, welcome to Botany Insider. So in this lecture, I'll be sharing with you some important tips that you could use if you're starting to prepare from this particular point. That is how to qualify the CSIR UGC NET Life Sciences examination in three months. So it's never late to start off with the preparation. Even if uh, you are starting off with your preparation from now onwards, there are still chances that you could qualify this examination in three months itself. So before starting with the video, if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, I would highly recommend you to subscribe to my channel for getting the updates of all the videos, all the informative videos that I post on my channel almost daily so that you could be benefited for your preparation as much as possible. So now let's start with this particular video. So now we have two types of students at this particular time as we are in the July month so now from now onwards there are almost three months or maximum three months that we have for the preparation or by the time we would be having the notification of the examination this is just a prediction so now the first type of students are the one who have completed their syllabus and now are in their revision mode. So for them also, I have made a detailed video of how they can use these months in the best productive way. I put the links of the same in the description box for you to check out that video. So now in this video, we'll be talking about the second type of students that is those students who are trying or who are starting off with the preparation from this point so there could be many reasons for the same they might be involved in some other activities or in their college work so there are chances that we have some students for this category as well so for these students the most important tip that i would recommend you from my experiences do not go for depth just go for to the point information and just complete your points or just complete your topics as soon as possible. The next important tip is that do not go for diverse resources that is do not have for a single point do not go for many channels or do not wait that you want the best of it no just stick to one resource and just try to revise it in the best way possible. The next important point is previous year questions. If you're starting off from this particular point also, do not skip out the previous year question. They would work as a miracle for you. They are very, very important. Do not forget to insist upon the previous year questions. The next thing is about the mock test. So even if you're starting at this particular point, I would recommend you that you still have three months. Three months is almost 90 days. So we all know that things can be done if we want in these 90 days as well it's all about our dedication and it's all about our willpower that how much we want to work hard next important point is binge study as we have the quote for binge watching on the netflix in the same manner binge study do not stop if you want to qualify in three months it would be very very beneficial for you but also do not forget to take breaks see we have 90 days if we plan these 90 days in the smartest way possible there are high chances that you could qualify this examination all you have to have is a smart strategy correct planning and to the point study at this point most important thing is to cover the topics the depth of those topics could be covered afterwards but at this particular point i would recommend you just have to the point studies understand the concept and just have the information in your hand and then revise it most important thing is do not go for rote memorization this is not something that would work important thing is make a conceptual understanding or make an imaginary concept in your mind that for example if you are studying about speciation so this topic is maximum of one hour or maybe less than that so now in this one hour what you have to do is that try to have a conceptual knowledge about that what speciation is all about and what are the various types of speciation so now there is one more important thing that we have to understand and that is practice 
Practicing is very important. You can practice it from the previous year question. They are the best source for you. You can find all the previous year questions if you do not have the book or you do not have the access to the book at this particular time. I would suggest you just go to the official site of the CSIR and then download those papers. If you have any difficulty in downloading, do let me know. I'll provide you with the question papers on my Telegram channel where I have provided some of them. So important point is that you have to make up your mind to start your preparation if you lose hope that 90 days are not enough no if you want you can qualify in these three months itself important points are be to the point do not go for the depth study abhi utna time nahi hai go for to the point study and just complete your topics with a good understanding understanding does not mean that you have to go in depth of that you have to understand for example i have taken the example of speciation go for speciation just understand that what are the various types of speciation and then you're good to go for that particular topic then after you revise First, you have understood, you have gained the conceptual knowledge related to the same. Now, the point is that how to note them down because notes are also very important. And in these 90 days, making notes is a big task. So for that point, try to make notes as fast as possible. Have a page and then just have bullet points and just write down the most most important points for example speciation is what it is the formation of a new species so just write down speciation at the top and then the first point is formation of new species that's it then we have four types of speciation that is parapetric peripetric allopetric and sympetric so just make a flow chart and then write down all four of them and the important characteristics of each one of them so by this way you could minimize the space and also maximize the information. Now, what are the sources that you have to study? See, so on my channel itself, you can find 150 plus videos for your preparation. They are in the best possible way. I have tried to make them as detailed and also to the point possible. So you can use these videos. There are many, many videos present that is for the plant physiology. You can find the videos for the biochemistry unit as well. Let me just highlight all the lectures that you can find on my channel. So the first one is plant physiology. 70% of plant physiology could be completed from this playlist itself. You would not have to go to any other way or any other source for completing plant physiologies. 70% portion from my channel. Channel. Then we have the topics of ecology. Many, many topics of ecologies are also complete. Then biochemistry. I have uploaded approximately 12 to 13 lect lectures of biochemistry as well. Then we have the topic of applied biology. I have completed this unit in the best possible way. So just watch those 8 to 9 lectures. This particular unit can be completed. Next, we have the unit for unit number 13, that is the methods in biology. So for this unit, I have first uploaded one video in which there are many techniques, almost all the techniques and their important application. That video is a must that is very very important you can find at least one question from that video because every year we have matched the following type question or unit 13 say match the following questions ke kaafi high chances hote hain and in addition there are many other topics completed like microscopy also we have many other topics you can just uh, uh, go through that particular playlist i'll provide the link of each of these playlists in the description box just check them out and just use them in the best possible way if you do not want to make the notes of it the first recommendation is i would ask you to make notes because notes are the most important thing but if you find that you take a lot of time in making notes you can take screenshots of the videos or each of the slides that I use. I have made the slides in the bullet points. There are no paragraphs written. They would be helpful for you, for you to have a quick revisions as well. In addition, I'm also conducting various mock tests on every topic, every Friday on my Telegram channel. I'm uploading that. 
plus we are having a discussion of the same on the youtube channel live every sunday of that particular week itself do not skip out part a because part a would work like magic for you all this is a rank booster i call this particular part as a rank booster reason being this part if given only 20 to 30 minutes daily could work as magic i used to study daily for i guess 20 to 25 minutes itself just to for ensuring that i do not skip out this practice so if you give out just 20 to 30 minutes to part a daily it can enhance your chances of qualifying this examination i am also conducting one particular session for the part a general aptitude we have a live session every week for this particular part so that for you to give at least 10 to 15 question practice from my side every week so it would be beneficial for you in one way or the other so next important point is that how to make sure that you study well for that you have to and have to have a schedule in your hand see now it's like we do not have to go to any colleges or there is no regular schedule of us going out so so for using this time you can have at least 10 to 12 hours being prepared or being used for your preparation use these 10 to 12 hours and try to avoid social medias as much as possible just switch off your social medias they are of no use to you they do not give you anything beneficial in your life so i would suggest you just switch off your social medias for these three months and lag jao padhai pe it's very very important and also it would benefit you it would save a lot of time of yours as these three months after that you qualify and then you can apply for wherever you want be it phd or be it in any lab depending upon your preferences or depending upon your future plans so i would recommend you use these three months cut off from the social medias be in a bubble of just hard work and dedication hard work summed up with smart work smart work is very very important even if you have six to seven months for this preparation even then smart work is a very important part of the preparation so work smartly plus have a dedication in your mind that yes you can do it so this was all that i wanted to share i hope these points would help you out in some way or the other let's just quickly summarize what we have done first thing is to the point study do not go in depth because we have a little less time left and if you want to get the most of it take your time and just be uh, and just have to the point studies and you're good to go next thing is revision do not go do not go to the exam without revision the next thing is mock test very important then we have the previous year question again very important next is simplified resources that is do not go for diverse resources stick to one resource and just go for it along with that we have smart work smart work how with a proper planning and how to plan i have just told you the same in addition to that have a dedication in your mind if you have a dedication or if you make up your mind that you have to qualify no one can stop you from qualifying this particular examination even in three months there are many students who qualify within a month or within two months so you still have three months left I would suggest you do not think about ki result kya hoga, just go for it, give your best shot and just try to qualify it and just try to be focused upon every single day. Do not think about ki after 90th day kya hoga. Make sure that when you are on the first day, on the second day and on the third day, what you have to do is you utilize these days first every single step would lead you to this particular point where we have the success waiting for ourselves and this success would be all dependent upon continuity plus the 
consistency be consistent in your preparation just switch off your social medias cut off from everywhere and then just study so this was all so i hope these points would be helpful for your preparation in one way or the other if you are starting off with off with your preparation at this particular point so if you like this video please do not forget to like share and subscribe to my channel and also do not forget to join me on the botany insider that is my telegram channel you just have to search botany insider on telegram or the other way around is i have provided the link of the same in the description box so just use that link and you'll be able to join the channel so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you very soon